all across the nation are gearing up for the Great American Eclipse. But do you have the right gear for the big event? NASA put out a bulletin earlier this evening warning people to be careful when buying eclipse glasses online. The agency says not all the glasses are the same, and some can even cause damage to your eyes. CBS 13 meteorologist Lisa Meadows is live on the roof of our West Sacramento studio with more on how to safely see the eclipse. Lisa? Of course, we're all told as kids not to stare at the sun, but the sun's going to be the big star of the solar eclipse event coming up here next month. So doctors are warning, if you're going to watch it, make sure you do so safely. If you were to stare at it long enough for a large amount, you know, long enough period of time, you could potentially go blind. NASA is warning astronomy fans not to be blindsided by faulty eclipse glasses. And there have been a couple reports of people selling these glasses and they're not up to standards. Sporting the wrong pair of shades for the big solar event could permanently put you in the dark. As the sun comes in, it kind of gets magnified by this lens and it damages the retina in the back of the eye. It may be a while before you could go completely blind, but it doesn't take long to start seeing some damage. It's actually often like an episode. Like they'll say, I remember when I was in grade school, I was looking at the solar eclipse and ever since then, there's been kind of a spot in my vision. So it can even be just a really short period of time. So how do you know your pair of glasses are safe? Every pair of solar viewing glasses you buy should have a logo that says ISO on it. And you also want to look for the number 12312-2. The film of these glasses have a special filter which greatly reduces the amount of light reaching the eye. It's also important though when you use these that they're not old, you know, you look at them that they're not scratched or damaged so that they're still safe. Now what about the lucky few people that are actually going to be in the path of the total solar eclipse where the sun is completely blocked out by the moon? Well, experts say for those couple of minutes it's safe to look without the glasses, but of course right before then, right after you're going to need them, so just make sure to be safe. All right, very good, Lisa. Thank you very much. Live from for us on top of our studios, right up there. She.